well, they've been get one kind uh, extra to be in Sunday now on Tuesday about how one particular young man they use coffee, they paint different different things. Uh, we not get some messages from some people where they say, oh, oh, as a way they talk based on popular demand. Say they want to see him again, so we don't decide. Say we go play him again for now to see uh, coffee meets art exhibition. Maybe now see us. Some people they drink coffee, other people they use and they paint, they make money. Wanna enjoy this one. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know how it is, your boy, that were AKA Fresh, and anytime you see this face, you hear this voice, you're locked on to the best event show on TV. Yes, we're right here at Imutu Restaurant, where it's happening at Victoria Island. It is an amazing art exhibition put together by an amazing, phenomenal, I'll call him a painter, but this guy is phenomenal. It's Ekene Ingege's Coffee Meets Art. He's giving you art with coffee. Guys, really, and you can see behind me, this is an amazing coffee table display with amazing world leaders, and this was done with coffee. So ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be talking to him today, and we're going to be showing you other paintings that he has done. Amazing stuff. So stick around, guys. Don't go anywhere. My name is Ekene Ngige. I'm a visual artist, a coffee painter. Um, I decided to have this minor coffee painting exhibition this year in preparation of a major one for next year, 2019. Um, my theme for the year has been peace. So every work, every artwork I've painted this year, especially the ones I'm displaying right now, this coffee break um, exhibition is themed on peace. Peace, why? Because um, for the past few years, it's been very violent in Nigeria especially, and around the world. I'm a Nigerian and I know how much violence uh, I've actually experienced on TV, even in person and all. You know, with the Boko Haram, the headsmen, the Biafra, there's been one issue or the other here and there, and it was getting too unbearable. And I've realized that people have been trying to pass this message of um, stop this, stop that. Our leaders and all have been all blocked ears. So this is my own way of saying, of passing my message. This is my own way of trying to reach out to the whole world, not just about, not just Nigeria. US, Mexico, everywhere, North Korea, Syria, the war is everywhere. You know, there are innocent children dying, there are innocent people dying, and we just need to find this peace. So I decided to do this, the Coffee Break, Coffee Meet Art Exhibition, to pass my message the little way I can. And my message of peace is being passed today. The Middle East, Islamic woman and she's passing the message to those violators of um, religious war you know the Christian and Muslim issue has been a long has been a very long one and um, she's adding the cup of coffee over to the violators that we should find peace and come as one together I don't know who Kofi Annan is so um, I, was, I had the idea from one of my PRs to actually make a portrait of Kofi Annan when he passed. And I respect Kofi Annan so much for what he represents and I wanted to do something special, something unique. Yes, the coffee painting idea has been unique, all right, but for me it wasn't enough. So I came up with the idea of using the roasted beans. This is the first time I ever used the roasted beans and the coffee itself to make an artwork. And it came out very well. Kofi Annan is an African, as black as the roasted beans, as strong as the roasted beans, as peaceful as coffee. And I decided to uh, portray all those things in one piece without having different, different pictures. So this is Kofi Annan, and I called it Kofi Annan. So it's a tribute to Kofi for his life well spent on it.
I started painting with coffee. Um, accidentally, I spilled coffee on my notes during a meeting and it looked very nice. I actually thought I was the only one that had this idea actually, but after I developed this coffee painting, I went on Google and found out that there was actually a bunch of artists out there in Europe that are already painting coffee. <laughs> See how the, how the mind works, creative mind, whatever you're thinking about, someone's already thinking about it. But yeah, it came out very, very nice and it's working out very nice for me. Since then, um, my clients have actually preferred coffee painting to acrylic and watercolors. I've had clients from all over the world, Europe, Asia here in Nigeria, here in Africa, and it's been moving quite well. To enjoy more of this, our Ogunge videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.